time is the best. When he inform us, our own duty is just to execute. When the Spirit of God inform what he want us to do, we as his servant, children, is just to, to execute and obey what he has instructed us to do. For the, the history of Man Zion Church of All Nations, I believe this will be the, it's our first ever Saturday service for the past years, for the past 13 years. The first ever Saturday service, which is unique. Just Saturday to worship him and go back. And it's so special, particularly in my life and those who are in the same the same echo and line with me for today is our fruitful service as the spirit drop in my heart and it will manifest for those who came with sincerity with truthness in them many of you you have been asking questions many of us has been asking question that why am I not fruitful again? When I say fruitful, I mean when someone is complaining, when you too much complain, means something is wrong somewhere. When you too much complain, you touch this, it fails. You touch this, it does not go. You organize it, it scatter. You put this in place, at the end of the day, it do not work. 
there are many questions that goes on in our heart. And the answer is only within us. The answer is only within us. Some of us feel that the cause of what we are going through is caused by some, some individual or a particular person. It's caused by us. Only unforgiveness can hold you captive. Only unforgiveness can hold you down. And nothing will work in your life. Fear can also hold you down. Fear. This service today is special for those who will cherish it in their heart. It's, a very, it's very brief. No prayer. My concern, the fruit you have brought it is the spirit of God that permit us to play the past clip. The past clip that you people for so many you watch it. It is the spirit of God. I call the children I say play this clip. They should know that it is not Benjamin. Go and play that clip. The mountain you brought on that faithful day was not given to you by the ministry. It is not a particular person that gave it to, to you. You brought it by yourself. That is the purpose of us playing the clip you just saw. The Spirit of God says, Benjamin, go and play that clip. Because your people do no longer believe that I'm in you. That is why the clip was played for you to see. You brought it. I don't know where you came from. The, I don't know where you, you came with the pieces. I don't know. You, maybe you removed it from lion mouth or from python mouth. But I only gave instruction to you that the spirit says indicate in my heart, tell them to bring their own and the clip you saw, you saw what happened. That one now, it works, it was working on that day on the, on the external for you to see. But this one, if you are committing sin, take care after this food you will eat. D away with sin. I believe you brought the fruit now. I believe it's not the ministry that, that gave you now. Talk to me. So when carrying back home, you are not carrying back home the same fruit you brought here. Get me clear. As you are carrying that fruit back, it is not the same fruit you will carry back home. As you are here now, begin to confess your sin. Begin to ask Jesus to forgive you. you we are in his presence. Because that fruit, either it will work for you or it will work against you. I just want to prepare your heart. Either it will work for you, or it will go against contrary. Begin to confess. Because you will be troubled. Please, just mark it. Some of you have testimony that it is Jesus that has made it happen. But you cannot testify because you are still doubting. That is this really from this ministry? Is it Jesus that really did it? 
you are still doubting inside of you. Many of you. So, I've never called for fruit service. And the purpose of the fruit, I want you, I've been pleading with the Holy Spirit that, oh Lord, your children are no longer fruitful. They too much complain. They do this. So don't, don't, don't fear and think that as I'm confessing now, as you will live here and continue doing your rubbish. And then because you have ate the fruit, it will work for you. The fruit that you brought, I will declare, I will not pray. I'm not praying today. I will declare the same way I declare on that mountain. Don't joke. I know your name is Joke. Be responsible. You remember my message of this year? Huh? Eh? You know my message here now? Is what? Yes. So if you don't, either you begin to pray that, oh Lord, I'm the one that bought my fruit. Don't bless it so that when I'm going back home, let me eat normal fruit. Are you getting me? Don't laugh. Oh. This issue, this event I'm holding today, it came like this, bam, that. On the 20th, this day, you organize this. Don't wait until demon comes someday and confess. As you are sitting there, either you confess that, oh Lord, it's not the ministry that gave me the fruit. I brought it by myself. Don't affect it. As I'm going back, well, let me eat my normal fruit. But if you know if you have not been disciplined all these three months, then you want to start it today. Start it now. Say, Lord, give me strength to discipline myself and discipline my activity, my ways, before taking the fruit. Because you are no longer fruitful to be true. When things are not working in your life, you are no longer fruitful. Let us agree. When things are not going the way it should be, you are no longer fruitful. Viewers, thank you. You are also included for the message. It is not common, but when we hear from the Holy Spirit, we just execute. I know some of you have got your own fruit of your choice, viewers. Connect by faith. Desert yourself from wrongdoing before taking the fruit. Because when the fruit will be blessed, then you take it, it will, tr it will trouble you. When you trouble you, don't call for your for your medic, your specialist. Yeah? Yes. You see, except you are except you are greedy that you will not come and testify. You see, the fruit is just symbolic, but the power will back the fruit. The fruit you are just carrying carry in your hand is just symbolic. That's why I say you should bring that fruit. It's just symbolic. It's like the same with the, the living water service that was held here. And I was not there. You both saw what happened. <laughs> eh? I was not there on Thursday. And those who were there saw what happened. The same way. The same spirit of Thursday is the same spirit of today. The same Jesus of yesterday 
is the same Jesus of today. So please, give your attention now. It is our fruitful service. I want the inside to be renewed of you. Many are called, few are choosing. Our message title will be this way. We need to go in his way. A fundamental. We need to go in his way before we bless the fruit. Then we can go back home. Tomorrow is Sunday. We will pray tomorrow and tomorrow is service. Why am I not harvesting fruit? Amen? That is the message and it's a question for us. You are included for that and I'm also included. Why am I not harvesting fruit? Where do you want to harvest the fruit? Huh? If that question is coming, a message title, that why am I not harvesting fruit? Where do you want to harvest it? Eh? Where? Why am I not harvesting fruit? You want to harvest it where? Because it's a question. That is a message title for us. Why am I not harvesting fruit? So you ought to answer. You ought to answer. Remember, on Sunday last week, I spoke, I declare that the greatest and the highest ministry is truthful ministry. The highest and the greatest ministry on earth is truthful ministry. So if you are not truthful, you cannot be fruitful. It is true. If you are not truthful, you cannot be fruitful. If you are not truthful, you cannot be fruitful. Why am I not harvesting fruit? That is the message that will guide us. It's a question for you. True is where here we may know what the message that is saying. Go in the book of Second Thessalonians. The book of Second Thessalonians, chapter two. We take from verse thirteen to fifteen. Second Thessalonians chapter 2 verse 13 to 15. When you are living here, those who are seeking fruit of the womb and you are you you, you have reject all the medicine that the witch doctor gave you. Hmm? Those who are seeking fruit of the womb, don't go and combine it with medicine. Don't go and combine it with herbs. It will, that fruit will do many things for you if you believe. That fruit that you will take back home, you pieces it and begin to eat. It will do many things for you. I'm telling you the truth. I'm convinced of what I'm giving to you. Even the sickness in you. You will fight it. Amen? Amen? What that comes out of you cannot even bring life. But it's what that comes in can bring you life. What that comes out may not give you life. But what that goes in can bring you life. But we ought always to thank God for you, brothers and sisters, loved by the Lord, because God chose you as first fruit to be saved through the sanctifying work of the Spirit 
and true belief in the truth. He called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. So then, brothers and sisters, stand firm and hold fast to the teachings we passed on to you, whether by way of mouth or by letter. Examine the way I've been declaring since the day you make up your heart to start worship in Mount Zion Church of All Nations. Sit there now and ask yourself if Benjamin had been compromising with the word. I'm your brother. I'm your son. Ask yourself if Benjamin have been compromising with the word because I know we all sitting here knows the truth. We all sitting here knows the truth. And only truth will make way for you. Truth may, may delay but it will surely come to pass. Truth is like a seed that you plant. No matter how it will delay, at the end, it will be recognized. When I say, why am I not harvesting fruit? Most of you, if you were a plant, you will have been wood since under the fire. You know fire site now. You know pot when they put pot on top. Eh? If you were wood <laughs> tree in a forest, they will have burned you ever since. With fire. They will have used it to prepare food. Food. You. They will have used to prepare food to eat sins. When you are not contributing in society and then you have no impact in society, even right up to your own life or your immediate family, me, you have no use. I say if you will be you've been at now firewood now, three for forest now, they will don't take a cool conch of sins. That is the message that I have answered you. You know, conch of need plenty wood. That strong one that make plenty charcoal. They will have used you. <laughs> that is why. You are not fruitful. Simple. Why am I not harvesting fruit? Because you are not what? You are not fruitful. You cannot harvest. You only harvest when you produce. But you are not producing. How do you want to harvest? Even some of us that we are here, you have been using this, you have been using that to sustain your womb. I want to give birth. Uh, doctor said I have HIV. Doctor said I have gonna uh, uh, this uh, staphylococcus. I have this. I have that. Have you ever take time and sit and examine your activities? Have you ever sit, take time, examine yourself? Even the medicine you have been taking cannot heal you. The others antibiotics you have been taking for this, for that. You go to this, you hear on radio, there's a doctor here that can turn your womb around. You jump, you go there. There's a doctor that can prepare you medicine for that, your HIV. You go there. There's a doctor that can prepare you medicine for that, your waist. You go there. Have you ever 
take a brief break and sit somewhere in a quiet place and examine your life before seeking for remedy, have you Some of you that had been with me here in the past, the fruit that was always at my altar, hardly you will go there. Because today you have brought your own. I know some of you, you have brought 5, 10, 6, 20, 100, it's inside your bag. It is food. When the Spirit of God to arrange the platform here, that same fruit will still come back. The fruit will still come back here. On my altar here. Have you take time, sit, ask yourself, what is the cause of my predicament? You may be the cause. Then you are looking alternative outside. Where the, the, the solution is with you. Whereas the solution is with us but you are looking outside. Please. Even I myself here, yeah, this, when I was putting on this, it's, it's so special. It's just that they give me instruction that you put on this, this attire before going to bed. <laughs> I just got up very early. I myself started ruling iron on it. That this is what you put on today. Please. If you are not fruitful, you are no use in society. If you cannot, your impact is what? Look at your age. You will see that no impact. What is your contribution? Even, your, even the family. Nothing is happening. Nothing. Some of us see going to church as a way to drag with the Holy Spirit. Some of us see in going to church, coming to church, is a way to drag with the Holy Spirit. Am I not going to church? Am I not in your presence all the time? Am I not worshiping Jesus on Thursday? Am I not in his presence on Sunday? Even this today, Saturday, that they say fruitful service. Am I not there? No. Jesus is not concerned about your attendance or your appearance. Everyone can attend. Everyone can appear. But is look into the manner in which you use to approach him. We can pretend, but we are not true. You can pretend on the outside, but you are not true. And let me tell you something. Hey, Benjamin, Papa, don't try all business. It's not going. You are, you have dry. So I, I, I organize this program so that your, your inside can wet again. Do you understand me? Eh? Things are not going again the way it was in my life. Things are not going the way. Tell your neighbor that you are dry. Ah. Are you begging her or begging him? Tell him that you are dry. Do you think that if a mango tree stand here and it is summer, it is time to produce. And then he is surrounded with purple. Purple tree, oranges. He will be asking strength from purple tree and oranges to, tree to, orange tree to give him strength. He believes it is his time to produce and he will produce fruit. It is his time to produce fruit. It is summer. He will throw the leaf to refresh his the body. Even, even trees, even these fruit, fruit, these are fruit trees, that's how they behave. Even this purple tree, you see the leaf, you see the, 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 the spot that you see that leaf will fall. If you look carefully, you will see that under the fresh one, the fruit is coming out. You, you don't even know your summer. You don't even know time to throw your flower. You don't have no time to produce. You are just there like this. You don't know. You don't know that what 
you cannot identify that what you are going through is caused by someone or is caused by Satan or is caused by you. But a fruit tree is aware that from this period to this period, I will produce fruit for humanity. From this time to this time, I will not produce. From this time to this time, I will drop down the other leaves. From this time to this time, I will start produce fruit. From this time to this time, they will start harvest me. You. Yeah, 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 yours is. We we'll start Manzayon Church of All Nations. That is that is your own eh? That is your own fruit. You do what? Uh, don't talk now. Is it my concern? We start. We start Manzayon Church of All Nations. <laughs> it's like that. It's like all of us sees a mango tree behind your house, and we believe. When it is time for harvest, we'll go there and harvest fruit. People will see that it's a mango tree. But time for harvest, no fruit. No what? So that is how some of you, you are confessing. And no, ben and no Papa. And no Benjamin. Please. Each day you are here, you are energized. Some of your neighbor do not believe you. Some of you, it is some of you are the one making people not to come to this church. You are in your house, you have four your arm. When it is Thursday, you carry your Bible, you are in church. When it is Sunday, you carry a Bible, you are in church. And then you are calling Holy Spirit. I want to ask you, if that Holy Spirit finally come, what will he meet to make it grow in your life? What? What will the Holy Spirit find in you to make it grow? You are just folding your arm. The same neighbor that is seeing you as a fervent worshiper in this church you still go back and be begging for Maggie mm -mm. So, some of you I said that uh, if you were this unfruitful tree they would have made you firewood sins they would have forgot about you <laughs> they would have made you wood to prepare beans Every year pass, I'm worshiping God. Every year pass, I'm worshiping Jesus. Every year is passing. No, there should be improvement in your life as a child. I mean, as a genuine child of God, there should be improvement. So I've been praying. The Lord says, I got, I got revelation about this program. I've been praying for you, not today, not this year, things that what is the way out, Father. He said, S-I-N has dried the nutrient in your people's life. S-I-N has dried nutrient in your people's life. You touch you one, faith. You touch you one, faith. You organize it, scatter. You plan, it does not work. Then you say you are a Christian. Then who is your father? The God you serve is who? The God we serve is a God that constantly makes things to happen in our life. Despite things may be tough, but you will be happy because you know solution is forthcoming. It's fruitful service. I say it is fruitful service. Don't just go home and start beginning to bite it here. I'm begging you. Don't, don't go home. I did not give you fruit. 
Church did not provide food for you. Don't go home and begin to say, um, uh, I'll be f- go down on your knee before you start, you start take it from your mouth. Or if you know you are not ready, better allow it there to get rotten. Yeah, even, uh, am I the one who bought it for you? <laughs> it is your money. Go and do it. But you can be rebuking the spirit of God not to come there now. So that when you are going back home, you eat your normal fruit. But if you allow Benjamin stand on this platform, declare that you are carrying back home. Uh, my, 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 my problem for today, this service for today, the mean of this service, it is for you to be watered on the inside. That is the meaning of this service. You are dry on the inside. You are dry. You are confused. You don't know where to do. You don't know what to do. You don't know where to, to go. You don't know how to do it again. You have lost all contact. Everybody has forgotten about you. Everything is not working. Then tomorrow you, you dress, tomorrow you are going to church. On the outside they see you as if you are okay. But you are, you are, you are dying on the inside. You need to be watered. The fruit you brought, begin to pray. Let Jesus take away, forgive you now. A prayer from a sinful soul can be repeated a trillion times. Begin to pray. Begin to pray in your spirit before you take it. I'm telling you, if the fruit you will take into your mouth, it will fight anything that was not planted by the Holy Spirit. Amen. You will fight it. You will see the reaction. If you, are, if you believe, trust it, it will fight it. <laughs> that is why the Holy Spirit permit us to play that clip. The clip you just watched. He said, allow them to watch what happened on that day. That you, you spoke to them, they should bring their mantle by themselves. The same thing with that fruit. We will not shout here today. But maybe you go and shout in your house. That is why the message came. Why am I not harvesting fruit? You want to harvest fruit from a tree that does not have nutrients. Yeah? Some of all of us here, we are farmers. Um, um, all my here are farmer. Only the way you see the way you are made, that maze, the way you see the stem, you are sure. But when you see that one, the way he's behaving, the way he started getting red. Mm-mm. He said, nah, he said nah, this section, so I would really enjoy finding this section. So this side, so you know, really do that way. That's how some of us are. If up to this day, the insult, people were insulting this ministry, insulting Benjamin, if things will not have changed, I will start asking questions. My brothers and sisters in Christ, we are not serving a God that is deaf and dumb. We are not serving a God that is a statue. We are not serving a God that does not speak. We serve a God when we talk, when we speak, when we cry. He sees, he hears, he walks, and he provides. That is the God we serve. He will not bless a lazy heart. He will not bless an abusing hand. If your hand is not abusing, you will not eat. If your legs cannot go places to organize, you will not be blessed. The first day, those who know about Mount Zion Church of All Nations, I did not look for a seat and sit and say, I have grace. I put myself into work. 
Today, I am fruitful. That is why some of you can receive solution from me. Through Jesus. <laughs> yes. Someone just came just around here some few days that made me a brother. I said, brother, you people, you people have done something. You know, this structure that we did, whether we have been used, used to with it, we did it, we don't know the important, but when someone is coming, when someone is coming and find it and see, he knows what you and I has done. Let me tell you, someone who is not fruitful cannot do what we have done. So, thank God, if you put me under fire side to cook corn chaff, you don't die with sumuku. I know born. <laughs> Maskin, eh? Maskin, na the wettest, the wettest place in Cameroon. You know, you know? That is, that is my body. You put me under to cook, I will not burn. You know when the wood does not dry, then you are struggling to prepare and then you are blowing. It's coming. What we call? Smoke. You try pull me under. Smoke. Do you know why? I'm productive. I don't only consume. I produce. It is when you produce, you begin to have impact in society. People begin to recognize you. But if you have the same standard with people, you are in the same. Look at this place behind here. The next five years, by the grace of God, the next five or ten years, it will become a city. This behind. It has not finished. Oh. From that farm road street entrance come down here, it will become like a city. What is in my heart? Just put ten years behind, twelve years behind. Those who knew about this behind, those who knew farm road street, how is it looking like? Please, most of us, if not because some of us here, we are living cops. You are walking on the street, on the roadside, at the roadside there. Satan no one has no impact in society. That's why he's just allowing you. He cannot attack you because he has soaked you all. It's like you are a, pop, like a, a, a fruit of pop, popona that you see very ripe, good, but inside they have eaten it all. Have you ever said about fruit? Popo? It's popo fruit. It's, 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 it's what? They call it witch. You see the popo good head, you see it okay, fresh. But inside, they have eaten it all. Witches and wizards exist, so they are there. But no one has the mandate to accuse. If you are with the Lord, you are stronger than them. They say, will you survive at that compound? Will you survive at Farm Road Street? Will you survive what you have started? I say, I'm not alone. I and the law are more stronger and majority. <laughs> but if I may ask, please, as you are living here today, 20th of April, Go and mark it somewhere at your calendar, at your jota. Father, as they take that fruit into their mouth, those who truly believe, like what our son preached here to us, absolutely believe, those who truly believe, oh Lord, as they take it, give them the knowledge of sensitivity. Give them that wisdom of creativity. Father, impact to them sense of direction. Father, may they be fruitful. That is my cry. That's my cry. I'm crying. That's my cry. It seems, if not, if not the super happening in this place, people will have taught I am like some of you. If 
not for the super happening in Man Zion Church of All Nations? They will say, the way you live a miserable life, I know that's how that your pastor also live. I am hungry, but I'm not desperate. Means each day has its own supply. And each day must have his strength to manage it. That is my strength. I don't force to get what I know I cannot get it. I go diligently, slowly, but effectively. Please. Some of you have been close to this ministry. It seems I see the ministry, the God we are serving here is, is, is a God like this statue, this, this pillar that stands here. No! This ministry, that is not his God. His God sees. His God, yeah. His God walks. He, his God makes things to happen. The ministry, that is his God. It is you. It is you. Anger, you keep it. Unforgiveness, you keep it. Malice, you keep it. I say, some of you, oh Lord Jesus Christ, I want food of the womb. I want food of the womb. You see your friend drinking, drinking alcohol. You say, Bob, you don't be taste my, my test, my test, all this more. Even a lady that she is praying to have a perfect marriage, she will not do extraordinary makeup. She will focus to make up her inside because her inside will attract his husband. Let me tell you something here. Character is spirit. Character is spirit. And when that spirit correspond with that your man, but you know what? Women, we are fool for women. Truly, when you love that lady, you become a fool. Most especially when you have tested her for some certain things and she stands as a mother, not as a girl, you can go fool for her. You don't even need all these dresses in the market. Just try to build character. Be fruitful. Be a mother, not a lady. Even you are 20, 25. Be a mother. You can be, be mature. When you, are, you have a little age. Some will say, you have, I'm in that relationship for 24 years. I'm in a relationship for 24. Not 24 months. So. Not 24 days. So. Means that I'm a lecturer in marriage. If you come, I will educate you. Hey, she has a, a very bad behavior. It's, it's, not, it's not my type. You will find your type. And you will see it. For she to be at your test, you need to walk and bring the best out of her. For she to be fruitful in that marriage, in that home, you need to exercise some patience. Don't always take your ground as a head. The same thing to our sisters and mothers. For that man to be your, your type. You must also go extra mile to put him at the state you want him to be. You say you are farmers and you have planted young granite. You have planted maize. You have planted cassava. Don't go and weed the grass and see how the crop will do. Eh? You are getting me? Don't pass again to the farm. You are getting me? Just wait after four months, go and harvest. You will eat your teeth. You do what? You must go for weeding. To give more strength, energy for the plant to do well. 
The same thing, if you are expecting Jesus to bring the promises come to fulfillment in your life, you must organize yourself. You must discipline yourself. You must live the way he wants. You must live in accordance with his wishes. Don't go and be doing your rubbish outside there and then you think and feel Jesus is so stupid. Jesus does not bless us. Jesus fulfills what he has declared in our life. We are in his presence to strengthen our weaknesses, to live right. I know all eyes are on me. If I make mistake, many people's faith will be broke. If I make mistake, many people will not be happy. So, I must do what? I must take my time to do the best out of me. I must take my time to do the right thing. I must take my time to be an example for those who are my followers in Christ. Today, you know, go church for evening. I beg, I beg. I, I don't go to church with the for my life. Church go bless you, yeah. So you think that going to church, you go and collect. You are blessed. The problem for you not to excel is caused by you. If you come out from those dirty games, Jesus come and fulfill his promises in your life. <laughs> you think that is church? Church is just one of the ingredient to make the soup taste. <laughs> Who tell that church you go and collect blessing there in church? Who told you that? Your pastor, Benjamin. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Not me. At times I'm here with you. Going back home, somebody has blessed me with 10,000. Tomorrow I will give to my wife, she will prepare food. That is a fruit fruit tree. Not going back and begin to run head task and begin to beg. A child of God beg only for a short while becomes a supplier to others for eternity. <laughs> Your period of begging is very short. Today, I'm crying. Man Zion is crying. But I'm convinced if I'm still alive or not, those who will take over me, they will supply for others. Yeah. I learned one thing to the sleeping soldier at synagogue. He says, suffer today and enjoy tomorrow. But some of you don't want to suffer. You want to get everything at the same time. You will come. If you force to get it, instead to bring you relief, it will bring you problem. People are asking me, Benjamin, what is your strength? My strength is patience. Endurance, no matter the circumstances. Confess success despite you are facing challenges. You know, go church today. I beg, I know, I know. I don't go for it past 10 years, which is not for my life. So you think that to just come and sit in the house of God in a church, it will change you. Don't change. Church will change you. <laughs> church will change you. We are here to correct ourselves. We are here to correct ourselves. This is, and this is what he spoke to them. This is what Paul delivered to the people in Thessalonians. That you are not fruitful because you are not truthful. If you are truthful, you will be fruitful. Some will say, there is no one perfect being on, on earth. Don't hang on that word. I have a message for you. The Spirit of God delivered a, a brief message for me that Benjamin, each person 
is sent on earth to create he or her own space. Mm. Today in the morning, I say, eh? yes, that each person is sent on earth to create he or her own space. <laughs> and when you create your own space, people will identify you inside your space. Don't copy. Don't measure. Don't, comp don't compromise. Stick. Truth always delay. Truth is like pregnancy. No matter how the baby will stay in that belly. We will use any medium. The child will come out. That is truth. So you that says, let me compromise. I've been receiving revelation about Kumba. I've not conquered Kumba. How can I conquer Sawes? The Spirit of God is revealing to me that Benjamin, don't blink. Hey, my son, don't blink. Stick on this your word. Stick on this your truth. People are among you. Thousands in Kumba are among you. They are using you as an example to other men of God. I got the revelation. They say what? That new Jerusalem TV is an example from others. And do you know why? Because I started with discipline. I'm still at the middle with discipline. I'm still on the journey with discipline. I will be inside the casket with discipline. <laughs> that is it, eh? You, you either reject me for that or you love me for that. <laughs> that is Benjamin. Don't, de don't stain my dress. You see my white? Don't stain this white. Don't stain it. Because I will not cause anything to stain it. I'm not perfect. I'm not strong. But I will struggle to live like Jesus. We can struggle. We cannot be like him. But we can struggle. We can have even 80, 70 average. Struggle. If you get 70, 80 average means you have passed. Because no matter how you will be so intelligent, that, that class teacher will not give you 20 over 20. He will give you 19 points. Means that the other point, he has kept it. Because you will go and insult him outside. Say, I finished class teacher, he, he, he says. He gave me 20 over 20. He will give you 19 point something. He will not give you 20, no one day. Yeah. Ask teacher, they will tell you now. They will say, ah, the child got it all. Now lie. They will look for another way to, to, to lie on a child paper. Go and ask, they will tell you. So you need to struggle. Please. I know that as we all, are, this is my own fool here now. They are here. They are here. As we are living here, don't just go inside and begin to start put the fruit in your mouth. Go down on your knees. Father, forgive me. As from this day, because I'm telling the truth, as you are taking that fruit, no matter the type of fruit you brought for your choice, I'm telling you the truth in the power of the Holy Spirit I stand on this platform. The inside of you will be watered. I said, I'm telling the truth. The inside of you, if I be a child of God, the inside of you will be watered. He will fight with all the plan that was not planted by the Holy Spirit. He will fight it. Is it sickness? Is it that cough? I don't know the name. Is it too bloggish? Is that five broad? That's too much that's too much that worry give you concern. Please. If you can even decide that I will not take the fruit today, take it even tomorrow. Take it even the next day. He said, in one week time, we'll take it. Let me fast before I take this fruit. Because all this period, I've also been in that same dimension before coming before you. Pray. You can keep that fruit for even four or five days. He said, let me pray first. Let me ask God for mercy. Oh Lord, forgive me. Please. 
let things begin to change. So that your neighbors will be jealous of you because of the God you serve. Amen. You have got the text we have read now. In that book of Thessalonians, second line from that 13 to 15. Eh? You have, you have, you, everything is there that we have elaborated here. Everything is there. He said, but we ought always to thank God for you. Brothers and sisters, loved by the Lord, because God chose you as first fruit, my God, to be saved. It is you. You need to be saved first before you become productive. You need to be saved. You are not saved from sin. You are not saved from sin. All what you are going through is the cause is sin to be saved by the Lord. Because God chose you as first fruit to be saved through the sanctifying work of the Spirit. And true belief in the truth. Live in truth. Live in truth. He called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. You may share in his glory. What is his glory? All the slenders of this world. You begin to enjoy all the privilege he has made for you. We will not meet Jesus before we start eat well. You must not meet Jesus before you start feed well. You must not meet Jesus before you start building houses. We are with Jesus along the way. The day we meet him is judgment. The day we meet Jesus, we see him. The day is judgment. So as you're on this path of Christianity, you're on this journey of Christianity, you are along with Jesus. He causes things to happen. He makes things to happen. He provides for you. He makes way for you. Because you are sincere, genuine with him. Please, let us be sincere after this sermon. People from overseas, have they forgotten you? They have not forgotten you. The manner in which you live your life with Jesus, Jesus will force even your enemy to bless you. You that have that store, even now that we say offering time, we don't know where that money is coming from. But if I know that this is what you are doing to get money, I will not collect from you. I will never. Whether you are giving me trillion, billion, I will not take it. Please. Jesus does not know money. But he can use those who are against you to bless you. He has and carry all men's heart in his hand. Jesus. He can turn it this way as he wants. He can turn it this way in his wish. Please. We are asking this question today. 20th of April. That why am I not harvesting fruits? Why? Ask that question as you are going back home. Ask the question time and again in your life. Why am I alive like this? Why am I not harvesting? Why things are not happening in my life? Then you will try to diagnose yourself and come out of it and be the person that Christ wants you to be. We are not the person that Christ wants us to be, but we are complaining. You want things to happen, but Christ is, is crying for your soul. He does not want to lose you, but you want to gain. You want to gain, but Christ does not want to lose you on the last day. Yeah? yeah, our problem is we want to gain. Gain is what? When you can be big houses, mansion, you have companies, you have children, you have houses, you, are, you have gain. But Christ does not want you to gain and then lose you. He wants you to gain, then get you. That is Jesus for us. You see, so then, brothers and sisters, stand firm on that 15. So then, brothers and sisters, stand firm and hold fast to the teachings we pass on to you, whether by word of mouth or by letter. Be strong. Go to the book of 1 Corinthians. 1 Corinthians 16. You take 13 and 14. 1 Corinthians 16, 13 and 14. It says what? Be on your guard. Stand firm in the faith. Be courageous. Be strong. 
That is an encouraging way. 14. Do everything in love. Hmm. Do everything in love. If you are standing firm and you are courageous and you are strong, do it in love. Do it in love. Let go. Forgive. Live as Christ wants you to live. If you are expecting, arrange yourself. Let me tell you something. If people are heaping insult to you, if nature is fighting you, it's because you are against him. If nature is fighting you, and then you know within yourself, you are innocent, Holy Spirit will come. He will strengthen you. Make you strong. Make you stand firm. As you are standing firm, I stand in here for the past years. I don't appreciate or carry my soldier eh, up that I'm so strong. Or oh, is product of grace. Before we love him, he first of all loves us. Our love to Jesus can never be measured with the love he has for us. The love we have with Jesus and the love he has for us can never be measured. Please, I know this is my own part. I will not be judged by the attire I constantly put on. I will not be judged by the color of my skin. I will be judged by the content of my character. The same to you. Those who say, those who confess, I have been in that church. I have been serving Jesus in that church. Ask yourself, were you living the life Christ wants you to live? Ask yourself, that why am I abandoned? Some of us, we are no longer productive. But, you can consume. <laughs> if you only have the spirit of consumption and then you don't have the spirit of producing, you are a waste product. You hear me? Huh? I, I try, I begin some 500,000, I put up over business, it no still go. Then you put up business, you put up money, you know, still, you know, go. Were you consume me? It's a question I'm asking. You had 500,000, you start a business. In the next three, four, five, six months, the money disappear, And then you confess, you are not even ashamed. You confess that, that money, I'm not seeing that money again. I'm not seeing my capital, things are not going away. Were you consuming? You're not answering me. The money just fly like that. Like, 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 like butterfly. The money was, eh? the money was, the money becomes um, a ice, ice block that you drop it here, it will evaporate. It will dissolve. I'm asking you people. The, the, spirit, the, the heavens gave me seed. Call it grace. The seed was planted in me. It's like you have capital. How did that money finish? 
is a problem. And you are you are really conf confessing it. You are you are really. I don't know. I don't know where they, they go on my hand. I did do and so you need to go. I'm asking you. Each day you go to the market, or you are you are investing. Were you consuming? Or the money was just going like this. How did you do with it? He said, you cannot answer, you cannot, you cannot answer me. The first area we ought to walk as a Christian is to produce. If this your body like this cannot produce, you are only consuming, you will become a beggar very soon. Me, your body does not work. You only consume. Only consume. You only eat. You only eat. Then you are not producing. Go back. Take pen. Go back to your expensive. How much is your house? How much is the feeding money? How much the bees for the month? If you, you need to go to Karabot, go to Karabot. If the house is 25,000, if to drop it, to go and pay a house of 10,000, drop it. Calculate that money, that 15,000 for one month, for one year is how much? Then if you are renting for five years, it's how much? We, 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 we lack we lack how I put it, we lack heart saving, but we, we you know we, we lack spirit saving, but we have it spirit consuming. Some of you when you just see money, you, are, you, you become mad. Some one hundred thousand you are you you are, you are you crazy. Everything that passes is very interesting about you, you buy it. Anything I want to see is very it means you see it. Brothers and sisters in Christ, ask God to cut the spirit of arch. Ask Jesus to cut the spirit of arch. You know arch? Langa throat. It's arch. You, you want to eat this one? You see your neighbor? You see your neighbor? Only the only the, odd, the, the aroma that came from your neighbor kitchen. F from, the, from the arrow. And you know your standard of living in your family. You begin to confess. You, you taste that neighbor arrow yesterday. You taste that now. You taste that arrow. Say yes, I taste it. The same thing tomorrow. Let me tell you something. Eh? Even now, they will collect money offering that you bless the house of God. The country you hear the amount of money now, you will crease. You say, what? Even tomorrow Sunday, you say, what? You know something? You come to my house, I've, we have, since 2011, because I don't know, I cannot be forced you to give me money in the house of God because I'm a pastor, because I'm committing sin, because I don't know how you are living in your house. I don't know how you're living. So if I begin to force you to be giving me money, I begin to lie to you that Jesus says, Holy Spirit says, you should give me one million, you should give me 500,000, I begin to lie. <laughs> it's a grievous sin. So I would, I would rather do what? Use what your heart has genuinely given. If you truly give out of what you have, and then God will accept it. But if you are giving not out of what you have, you are also committing sin. So from then now, what I see, ah, I'll calculate I will sit now, take pen, calculate all the expenses of the ministry, all the expenses of around me, calculate it all. Ah, and then if I want to buy even a pair of uh, 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 an attire, I will start calculate. Reduce the reduce your expenses. We want to live like those in Western continent, like European. They have, their government has stabilized their nation. You hear? Yeah. Your government has not done stabilization. Stabilize your life. How many companies are in Kumba that your government brought for you? 
How many companies are in Southwest? They are government brought for you. Southwest, Southwest is not depend on agriculture. So stop going to bar, begin to drink because kilo now is 6,000. It's opportunity for you not to grow. Heaven and hear your cry. He said, We are poor. It's only when you want to save, you are poor. But when you are consuming, you are not poor. Calculate. You that you are drinking, go and calculate that those bottles each day. Some of you, it is not that your eye clear. And your eye are clear, money has, has fly. <laughs> Some of you, Manzan has opened, has clear your eye. Benjamin has clear your eye, has removed the conjure on your eye. Now your eye has clear. Money is and money has fly. Because each day you were consuming no less than one crate beer. One crate you were consuming. Now like this money is no longer there. Now you cannot save. No, you can still do it. In the means of trials and challenges, you can still do. It is still possible. Money, each day you keep the money, it changes figure. Please, ask the Holy Spirit to give you the spirit of saving. Spirit of producing. Not spirit only to consume, consume, consume. Because there's no day you, you sleep without eating. Is that not true? How much do you save? Ask a question that way. If you can eat every day, you consume every day, because when you want to produce, you must save. How much do you save? If you know you eat every day 500, make sure you eat every day 350, you save 150. When you eat now, you come and sit. The astronomer, you fool. They say, um, you want to have this speaker in the house of God. Eh, I swear. Eh, you, 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 you lick. You, you swear. <laughs> I tell you, you can even go even on the floor, lick your tongue on the floor, say you don't have. But right, you have consumed. Yes. Whether you have what? You have consumed. But you cannot produce. Produce also means saving. When your husband is too much complaining and he's giving you 2,000, 3,000, if it's to repeat the plain okra, repeat the plain okra. Stop querying with him. That is not correct. But I'm not giving room for you. Because I know you will say, you know you better have a message for that 20th of April. Because I know you now. I don't preach what I don't practice. I preach what I practice. If you go, right, if you try to do investigation, you will know that Benjamin lives with what he says for the past 24 years that I'm in a relationship. I live with what I confess. So please, thank you for coming. I believe the good God that brought us together for this special service to bless our soul, to bless our hand. Because now, <sighs> As your hand, I, 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 do you know something? I pray for this for this service to be held early January. I pray, I pray, so that before you start plant. Eh? But as I pray, the Holy Spirit did not give me utterance. He does not give me go ahead. I pray since since October last year I was praying that such a service I want to hold before the, the start plant. You know. So, Father, some of you that plan August, plan August next year also. I'm telling you, my mothers, you, my fathers, as you are here, you that you say, I don't know what you have to do, but I give money, I lie. You will know what you will do after this service. Yeah. <laughs> I want you, I want you as only moment to be productive. Yeah. Productive means you work, you produce, you have the money, you save some, you use some. You work, you have the income, you save some, you use some. No, don't sit and fool your arm like this. Say, no, hey, I don't lose. You are not lost. You have found yourself today in Jesus' name. Yeah. I say, you have found yourself in Jesus' name. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Father, thank you for giving us the strength. I'm happy that you make an answer my prayer. Because that is what I was praying for. Because I've been crying that why are my people not fruitful? Why are they not productive? Why are they not fruitful? What is not happening in their life? I got the answer. They are dry. So I've watered you. With, with, eh? I've watered you now. Not their body, but their inside. You're getting me? Your inside. Your inside has been watered. Your inside has been watered in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name. 
Thank you.
bring out your fruits. Bring out your fruit. The same way, the same way you usually carry the water for you to be living by the Spirit of God. It's the same way. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Keep yourself. They are, they are present. They are present. They are present. When I say they are present, I mean the host of heavens. When I say they are present, I mean the host of heaven. It is not my program. It is not my assignment. I'm just there as a head boy to declare it. Father, through your spoken word in the heart of your son, that bring your people together for me to renew the insight of them. For me to renew the insight of them. Father, here I stand. Ash. Father, here I stand. Father, instruction came from you for them to bring something as a symbol that you will contact it to contact their insight. Father, here I stand as your servant. Father, the sign are enormous in our life. Father, you have shown yourself to me numerous times. Father, I pray Lord, as you declare this event for today, affect the fruit we carry from our hands. Affect the fruit they carry from their hands. Father, the fruit represents the beginning of a change. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Father, the fruit represents a beginning of a new way. Come on. Father, feed them. Lord, feed them, Lord. <sighs> feed them. Feed them with your endless strength. With your wisdom. Your knowledge. Your power. A new beginning. A new beginning. Father, show them the sign. Father, show them the sign. Father, show the sign to them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Father, show that sign in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Father, it was not organized by me. Come on. Come on. Touch them, Lord. Touch the medium from their hands. Touch the medium from their hands. Feed them, oh Lord. Come on. Shh. Come on. Father, touch them, Lord. 
Father, touch them, Lord. Touch them, Lord. Touch them, Lord. Please condition yourself. Be in attitude of meditation. I'm telling you, it is for you. Come on. Chase. Father, the medium, the fruit represents a new and a fresh beginning. Hey, come on. Chase. Come on. Dash. Come on. Come on. Come on. For a fresh beginning. Guys. For Man Zion Church of All Nation, Lord. Father, it is it is time. Father, it is time. Father, this are your sons and daughter. Father, Father, this are your sons and daughter. Father, this are your sons and daughter. Father. It's, your, it's, your, it's our day. It's the day you have declared and designed for this ministry. Father, these are your daughters and your son. Come on! Cash! Father, as they, as they take it, Lord, testimony should come, Lord. Father, be it to blockage. Father, as they take it, their womb will be fruitful in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Their womb, whatever they have declared, Father, that womb, that two blockage, be open in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be open in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> they say you are a debtor, Father, a tremendous door, Father. A tremendous door to be opened in the mighty name of Jesus. A tremendous door to be opened in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, this service today is so special for you. And you declare we have agreed. We have agreed. We have agreed. Your presence is what we want, Lord. Father, affect that fruit in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as they carry it now, whatever that was not planted inside of them, Father, may they find a reaction in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Father, react in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Holy Spirit of God, react in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Holy Spirit of God, react in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Holy Spirit, react in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah! Come on. Come on, Lord. Affect that fruit, Lord Jesus. Father, whatever that is not planted by you, Father, whatever in their system, Father, 
in their tendon, their bone, their blood, their muscle. Father, restore everything by your strength. Restore it, Lord. Restore it. Father, it's a fruitful service you declare. Father, it's a fruitful service you declare. Father, a fruitful service you declare. Father, 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 you declare. Come on. Be meditating. Remain silent. Meditate in your heart. The job needs to start now. As you are living here, the job from the host of heaven needs to start now. Begin to meditate. Begin to confess. Begin to confess. Begin to confess. Begin to meditate it. Meditate. 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 Begin to confess. Begin to meditate. 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 Say, Father, I'm in your presence. Begin to meditate. No going back the same. Begin to meditate. No descending from this heat the same. Begin to meditate. Begin to meditate. They are in our presence. They are in our presence. They are in our presence. But I trust them, Lord. But I trust them, Lord. But I trust them, Lord. Father, it's a fruitful day for them. Father, this fruit represents a new beginning in this ministry, Lord. Father, this fruitful service shows a new beginning in their life, in their activity. Father, a beginning, a, be, a fresh beginning, a fresh beginning. Father, whatever sicknesses they declare, they find themselves in their system. Father, as they take it, you are flushing it out. Father, as they take it, you are flushing it out. Father, as they take it, you are flushing it out. Father, as they take it, you are flushing it out. Father, be their their blood. Come on. You darkness there. You darkness in that blood. I call you by name. Today you are in trouble. Today you are in trouble. In that blood. In their tendon. In their kidney. In their liver. Father. That sickness disease. Trying to grow. That is already there. To blockage, I command that you to be open. They say, your womb no longer having fertilizer. Father, it is well. It is fruitful. It will consume. It will consume. It will remain. Father, is it your semen? Father, is it your semen? As they consume it, Lord, as you have declared for this event of today, Father, may that semen have strength. 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 In Jesus' name. Father, is it debt? They find themselves in debt. Father, may door of opening door for that business. Divine favor. Oh Lord, divine favor. Those who are already in business, divine favor. Divine favor. Divine favor. Divine favor. Father, those who want to start. Those who want to start, is, they find it difficult. Oh Lord. Make way. Father, inspire them with your wisdom. Father, inspire them with your wisdom. Remain silence. Remain silence. Remain silent. And meditate. We pray by following instruction. Remain silent and begin to meditate. Don't, don't fear yourself. Allow yourself for the Holy Spirit. Say, Lord, carry me along. Carry me along. When I pray, we hear instruction. We remain silent. By meditating. Begin to meditate. Begin to meditate. Begin to meditate. His glory is here. His glory is in our midst. 
His glory is in our midst. His glory, his glory is in our midst. His glory is in our midst. His I pray, I'm getting revelation. I'm getting revelation. You will see yourself. You will see yourself in your dreamland today in the middle of fruit. And that is the fruitfulness that has started. Hey! That is what I'm getting here. Eh? That Benjamin, <laughs> not only the your, your, your people, but the ministry, the ministry door, divine doors has, has been opened. He said, Benjamin, divine door for the ministry had been opened. He said, I can use any medium to communicate to you. I can use any medium to communicate to my people. He said, divine door had been opened in the ministry. He said, he said, divine door had been opened. This is what I'm getting now. That divine door for the ministry had been opened. You cannot explain it. Just believe. Say, just believe. And the door had been opened. Yours also had been opened. Your womb had been opened. What you have been praying for has been agreed, has been accepted, has been accepted, has been accepted, has been accepted, has been accepted. In Jesus' name. Father, I sanctify this precious fruit from our hands with your precious blood. Father, I sanctify this fruit from their hands with your precious blood. Viewers, today was a fruitful service, a special one, because it was designed by the Holy Spirit. As we carry our own, I believe you carry yours. I believe you carry yours. Be fruitful in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Viewers, be fruitful in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be fruitful in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All areas of your life experience fruitfulness. All areas of your career experience fruitfulness. All areas in your career experience fruitfulness. Are you seeking for a child? And the doctor says you have two blockage of viruses. What are those names I'm hearing? As you take this fruit, viewer, it is done and it is way in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is done and it is way in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. They say your spams are watery. Strength. 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 You say you are dry. You are water. I say you are water. Do you want I say you are water? You are water. You are water. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, affect the medium from their hand. Affect the medium from their hand. Lord, as they take it, open door. As they take it, open door. Amen. In their career, as they take it, open door. Amen. In their businesses, as they take it, open door. Amen. Father, I'm sure for testimony. Father, I'm sure for testimony. Amen. 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 Father, I'm sure for testimony. Father, all those who owe their debts, Father, it is right time for you to reward them. Father, it is right time for you to reward them. Father, it is right time for you to reward them. It is right time for you to reward them. It is right time for you to reward them. 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 In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Father, I bless those fruit. I cover them with the precious blood of Jesus. 
as you take it, whatever he will find it inside of you. Father, may there be battle in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hey! Father, whatever he will find on the inside of your daughters and son, may it be battle in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. May they be brought in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Father, their hands must be fruitful now. Amen. Father, their hands must be fruitful now. Amen. Their hands must be fruitful now. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It is where. It is where. Please cherish the fruit. Cherish it. You can choose as the Spirit will direct you. As the Spirit will direct you, you can say, okay, I'll take one day, two days, I'll fast before start using it, before putting it in my mouth. As the Spirit directs you, you must have, please, don't take it with fear. You must be in a state of tranquility on the inside. Again, I'm assuring you. When it starts happen, don't keep the testimony back. Don't keep the testimony back. You will not only see it on the inside, but you will see how things will begin to change on the outside. Because now you are fruitful. You see this fruit now? It's just symbolic. I said now you are fruitful. I said now you are fruitful. This fruit is just to give manure for the inside. This fruit now, as you take it, is to give manure on the inside. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. It is where, it is where I say it is where I say it is where sin should flee. I say sin should flee, sin should flee, sin should flee in Jesus' name. Thank you, thank you, thank you for coming and thank you for accepting Jesus' invitation. Here we are today. It was long awaited program and heaven had made it possible for us to be here. Those who are here, they were the one that was designed by the heavens that they will be there. Thank you for coming. By his grace, tomorrow is our normal service day on Sunday. Sunday is tomorrow. That will be, we'll find ourselves here to still keep the fire and keep the flame burning. Thank you for coming. We'll meet here tomorrow, 8 a.m. in the morning. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray. Amen. Thank you.